Hello, good evening, everyone. <clears throat> good evening, good evening. Hi. How good are evening. You? Hi, good evening, Lucy. Adriana, thank you. How are you guys? Holman, hello. Antonio. Good evening, teacher. Hey, good evening. How are you? How is everything? How was your day? Everything is okay, teacher. All right, all right. What about your day? How was it? It was a little, a little, a little easy. A little easy. All right, that's good. That's good. Good for you. Yes. Yes, it's Monday. It's Monday. Monday is easy. <laughs> yes. It's all time. <laughs> all right, all right. It's good. It's good to see you again. Well, it's good to have you here again. Oman, Gabriel, hello, Laura. Thank you. Thank you very much, people, for being here. What a pleasure. What a good weekend, huh? It was a good weekend for me. Christopher, hello. Welcome. Thank you everyone for being here. Another week to continue improving, getting better, trying to, to improve little by little. Yes. Today is a week. All right. Well, we got eight people, no, seven, seven people already. That's okay, that's okay. Uh, thank you everybody, everyone for being here. Thank you, thank you so much. All right, uh, let me take attendance. Okay, yes, let's start with uh, Adriana Maria Turcios. Present teacher. Yes. yes. Carlos Elivaldo, Abrego Marmol. No. <clears throat> Christian Alexander Arevalo Delgado. Here. Christopher Espitia Chipawa. Present teacher. Hi, hi. Fatima Denise Aguilar Marquez. No. Gabriel Beltran Perez. Present teacher. Hello, hello. Hello. Hector Francisco Morales. No. Isabel Hernández Hernández. No. Iván Petrovich Guzmán Aquino. Holman Saúl Girón Sánchez. Present. Hello, Holman. Laura Yasmín Portillo Andres. Present. Hello, thank you. Lucy Natalie Juárez de Ramírez. Present teacher. Hi, thank you. Magdaleno Escalante Orantes. Present teacher, good evening. Oh, yes, yes. Good evening, hello. I didn't see you there. All right. Uh, Nelson Antonio Rodas Rosales. Present teacher. Hi, thank you. Oscar Armando Romero Mendoza. <clears throat> All right. Uh, Pamela Carolina Molina Guevara. No. Roberto Carlos Hernández Cruz. No. And the last one is Rosalina Alvarado. I believe. Uh, <coughs> The ones that I haven't seen in the chat. Okay, Christian, hello. And uh, Hector, okay, okay. Let me just update it, Christian, here. Mm. Come on, okay. And uh, Hector. Who else? I see Ivan there too.
Okay, very good, very good. Thank you, thank you everyone for being here. <clears throat> it's a good day. Beautiful day, huh? We're gonna start here. Let me see. Okay, let me show you this. I'm sharing the whiteboard with you guys. Please confirm if you see it. Yes. Yes. Okay. Excellent. Thank you. Thank you very much for confirming. All right. Okay, guys. Look, the product line. Can you please tell me? Can you tell me what what do you understand about this? About the product? No, sorry, production. I said product. It's production line. Guys, what do you understand when you see these three words or these two words? Production line. It's like a system, like a integrated supply chain or something like that. Okay, okay. It's a system, she says. Very good, very good. Excellent, Lucy. Thank you, thank you. All right. Uh, let me see another, another person or another opinion. Yes, tell me, tell me. The production line. It's a sequence of steps to transform uh, raw materials in a product. Okay, okay. You say it's a series of steps, okay? Yes, I understand, I understand, okay. From raw material to, to, to the actual thing, okay. Okay, fantastic, fantastic. Is there another person? Another opinion? Yes. Teacher. Yes. A process, uh, people were, <laughs> a people and uh, joining for product. Any, any, anything. I... Uh, Hector, is the, uh, can you please repeat? Because there is a little interference. Hi. Uh, hello? 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 Okay, yes. Now I hear you. Oh, okay. <laughs> uh, uh, the process join with the uh, people for make um, a different product. Mm -hmm. Okay, okay, all right, all right. Yeah, pretty much what you're saying, what you're saying, it's, it's uh, the production line. Yes, it's where, where everything or, yeah, pretty much where everything basically starts, you know? Like like when they make sugar, it, it starts with, with the sugar cane. It has to it has to go to a process and uh, yeah. Okay, so the production line is the, the the before that material or before sugar, the whole process from the beginning. Yes, Laura, thank you. <clears throat> For me, it's a group and um, the similar product and um, product by uh, one manufacturer. Okay, that can work too. That can work too. Like, like, uh, probably the product line, not production. The product line will be with, with the, the same product. Yes. Okay, but that's a good opinion, and Laura. Thank you very much for that. Yes, Magdaleno. Uh, teacher, I think that the production line is the process what the factory use for or make a product uh, from the raw materials to the finished uh, product or yeah. launch that in the market. Yes, yes. Okay, pretty much the, the production line is like the very beginning, the very beginning of a product. Yes. Okay, it's when you have like the, what, what the product, uh, from what the product comes from, comes. Okay, 
Uh, yes, more opinions? No? Okay, that's okay, that's okay, no problem. Let's go back over here and let me share something else. Welcome uh, to the ones who just showed up. I see pa Pamela now, Fatima, Isabel, hello. Yes, and Elivaldo, thank you guys for being here. It's good to see you again. Now, we're going to continue. I'm going to show you the book. And guys, go to page number 25. Can I be on page 25? Yes. I am sharing that with you right now. Do you see it? Yes, teacher. Yes, all right, very good, very good. Look, <clears throat> this was the last class, remember? Unit number two. Today we start with unit number three. And that one is the production line. Okay, we are going to be talking about this topic a lot. And also, and also, there's going to be some vocabulary involved. Yes, which is good, you know, we learn more. And now, uh, well, we're gonna do that, all right? Look, today's objective is this. I will be able to describe the benefits of building a new product, uh, a new product prototype before manufacturing. Okay, and then we have a question here. What does prototype mean? Okay, guys, it's opinions time. Let me uh, make this bigger, hold on, hold on. Make it bigger, bigger. All right, now I can see everyone. Okay, guys, it's opinions time. What is, what is a, what does prototype mean? Yes, Christian. For me, is a uh, prototype is a uh, sample or example of the product that I want to create in a massive production. But I need to try it before uh, make a uh, a lot of this product. Mm. Mm -hmm. Okay, okay, okay. Very good opinion, Christian. Thank you very much. Uh, yes, I see another raising hand over there. Uh, Mr. Escalante, yes. Uh, think, uh, I think that the prototype is um, maybe a sample of a product when, when the, for example, the people who are studying uh, the market mm -hmm. doing, uh, make something for present or for doing a presentation for the actionists. The people who, who will pay for the for the launch of the product, I'm uh, I think that the prototype is um, one one uh, one sample is right one sample of the product for show the other people. Okay, okay, yes, yes, we will understand your point, and it's a very good one. It's a very good one. All right, it's, it's uh, what we show to a specific people, you know, for a very specific purpose. Uh, I see Lucy is also raising her hand. Okay, Lucy? Finished. Yeah. Uh, look like. Hello. Yes. It's a typical or preliminary, preliminary model of something, especially, for example, a machine from which other forms are developed or copied. Perfect, perfect, yes. Yes, basically what you said. It is what it is, okay? A prototype, it's the first, the first thing that you need in order to make a product famous or in order to launch a product. It's just a prototype. It's something that might work, might not work, okay? Yes, that's why it is called a prototype. Yes. Now look, it says here, we have a second question. Thank you everybody for participating. That's really good. It says here, what type of new products in your opinion require the building of a prototype before mass production? Guys, look at this what question is good. 
for example, a car. Okay. Can you tell us why? Because uh, this is a equipment that they can be affect um, a lot of the human life mm -hmm. because an accident or a failure that can be occur in, in the in the car. All right, all right, very good, very good. Amazing. Excellent, Lucy. Thank you very much for your opinion. Yes, yes, that was fantastic. All right. Uh, another opinion. Look at the question. What type of new products, in your opinion, require the building of a prototype before mass production? Good question. Yes. People, it's good to hear more opinions. Yes. Teacher. Hello. Yes. Thank you. Of the, of the 100% of the product, mm -hmm. maybe 90% uh, need a build prototype. This is very important for show the characteristic and, and the, how do you potential? Power? The potential. Powerful? Potential. Potential. potential of the product, of product uh, I want to sell. Mm. Maybe all the product need a prototype. If if I want to sell a product of uh, with good characteristic, good for for the people, I think. Okay. Yes. Yes. Excellent. Excellent. Yes. Actually, saying that that every product mm -hmm. has a prototype before or has had a prototype okay i see that that another person is raising his hand michael leno yes thank you uh, teacher um, in my opinion and my criteria uh, the, that kind of product who uh, who needs a prototype mainly mainly have to be uh, machines, for example, phones and cars, motorcycles, etc. I think so. Okay, okay, yes, yes. All right, Magdaleno, very good, very good. Christian, go ahead, Christian. Yes. Uh, I think that uh, when you have, or uh, when you create, or you have a, an idea of, a, of an, a startup, you make the uh, a prototype before create the main product because you if you want to sell to someone to inversors if, when you have a prototype you can sell it and test your product before create a massive production mm -hmm. if the starter is good the product and the inversion are going to be good yes Okay, okay, very good, Christian, excellent. Thank you very much. All right, uh, is there another person? No, okay, very good, very good. Well, this one is kind of easy, right? It's kind of easy. Mostly machines need a prototype, or I believe and I uh, support or back up what, what Hector said before, about, about this, right? He mentioned that uh, these companies need a prototype before, before being launched, because it's really, really, well, it's an obligation, I think, right? Or it's like, a, how can I tell you? A business obligation to have a prototype. Yes. Okay, very good. Now, there's another question that says, does your company make use of prototypes? Does your company make use of prototypes? Guys? No, yes, yes, no. Looking for... No, 
Okay, it's okay, no problem. Don't worry, don't worry. It's fine. In my company, well, in my company, we don't have machines and, and we don't use machines, so we don't need prototypes. Well, probably we don't know, right? We don't know. Maybe uh, we're using the, uh, a printer that has been a prototype or uh, it's possible. Yes, Magdaleno, I'm sorry. I didn't see your hand. Okay. My, uh, I work as a pastor. We don't use prototypes. It's, okay. uh, I All don't right. like, I, I don't have that. Okay. All right. All right. That's fantastic. Don't worry. Don't worry. Yes. Okay. Okay. There are some places in which we don't need prototypes. Okay. I think this is for like companies that, that have like big products or, or potential products. They have to do this. Yes. I was, I was trying to remember uh, this cell phone uh, model that came out a, a few years ago. It was, I think it was Samsung. I'm not really sure it was Samsung. That was a very bad cell phone that, no, no, it was not app that exploded. Do you hear about that? A cell phone that exploded. It was famous. The iPhone. Amela, iPhone. Amela, we cannot hear you. Fatima, yes? iPhone, I think. Was the iPhone? I'm not really sure. <laughs> okay. We, we cannot hear you, Pamela. Was an, I was on Samsung Mobile. Right? I think, yes. it, was, I think it was Samsung. And it, it is uh, explode during the charging. Uh -huh, exactly, exactly. Yes, yes. Okay. <laughs> For these people, that they, they have prototypes, but not good ones. And uh, apparently, they started selling the prototypes, not the real cell phones. And that's why that, that happened, you know. That's why it's really, really important to have, you know, the prototype before doing the whole, the whole final, the final thing, you know, which is the product. Okay, thank you guys for your opinions. Do not buy Samsung, okay? <laughs> no, it's okay. You can buy yourself one, all right? Yes. I have a Samsung, no problem. <laughs> okay, let's continue. Look, the second part. Tom and Diana are discussing ideas to begin prototyping a new bicycle model. Read the conversation and take turns practicing. All right, let's do this. Let's see. Let me read this to you guys. It says the accelerator, 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 all right, has green light to be pr produced. Now we need to work on the prototype. Great. I think our best choice is to hire steel masters so they build a good prototype to help us spot any flow we haven't identified in the design. I agree, Tom. The prototype will help us, will help our manufacturers to be, to be very accurate with the design of the handlebars, the frame, the saddle, which uh, are the innovative features of the accelerator. accelerator. Good point. In addition, the prototype will ensure communication is clear. They will know exactly uh, what you want. Totally. Then I'll work on a sketch of the parts and you might want to start with the description and the specifications of each. So a steel masters to start working. All right. All right. What a good one. What a good one. Okay, guys. Very good. We got the accelerate, accelerator, accelerator. <laughs> what a word. I don't know how they came up. I don't know how they came up with this with this uh, <laughs> with this name. All right, all right, guys. Uh, do you have any vocabulary questions? No, we're good. Teacher. Yes. Uh, what does mean accurate? Accurate. Accurate. Yes. yes, means exact, exact. 
to be to be very exact with the design. Yes, it's a synonym, and this one is a very a very formal one or a very professional one. Accurate. Yes. More questions about the what's the meaning of saddle? Saddle. Saddle. Yes, yeah, saddle is uh, for the chairs, silla. <laughs> yes, but it's 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 like like uh, how can I tell you? It's not the whole the whole object is where you sit, the part where you sit. Uh, how can I call it? Call it or like it's like like montura uh, uh, in Spanish. Okay, it's not the whole chair. It's where you sit. It's silla, but it's not silla. The whole thing. Como el asiento. Ah, exactly, exactly. Like, like the montura, like, like horses. Yes, <laughs> like that, yes. El marco y el asiento. exactly. Yes, the handlebars, the, I'm guessing this is a chair. Like the handlebars where you, you put your hands, the frame and the whole thing, and uh, the saddle. Uh -huh. I'm guessing it's a chair. More questions, people, about the, the, the vocabulary? Teacher. Yes. What does flow mean? Flow, imperfection. Imperfection, something that is not good or not perfect. Yes. Example, humans have flaws. We have flaws. It means we have imperfections. Yes. More questions? No, we're good? Okay, fantastic. Now, we are going to practice in couples. We're going to practice in the groups in couples. And both of you are going to continue down here with part three as well. After you finish with the practice here in part number two, I need you guys to answer the questions down here, all right? This ones, we got three questions, all right? Yes, only that. We're gonna practice, let me repeat. We're gonna practice the conversation over here, practice pronunciation, okay? And uh, down here, we're gonna answer the questions, yes. Yes, Magdaleno. Teacher, please excuse me. I am not available for read. If you if you can, please uh, uh, take my my position with uh, with other two people, or okay. give my opinion and don't read. Please. It's okay. It's okay. Thank you. Thank you very much. I think everybody heard. <laughs> All right. Yeah, that's okay. That's okay. Let me make the groups right now easy, easy. Oh, no, I don't know why this is not moving. I think it's frozen. <laughs> oh no. I'm trying to move it. What happened? Okay. I can do it like this. All right, all right. No, the other one. Here. And add one extra here. All right, we are ready. Guys, let's go. Practice, please. Remember that practice makes perfection. All right, let's go. My eyes are, are burning. Hello, guys.
Can you please join the groups? Thank you. Yes, there you go. Isang, are you okay there? Can you hear us? Thank you. Seconds. <clears throat> description of each so a still master start working all right the escalator has green light to be produced now we need to work on the prototype great i think are the best choice is to hire a steel master. So they built a good prototype to help us spot and any flaw to have an identified in the design. I agree, Tom. The prototype will help our manufacturers to be very accurate with the design of the handlebars, the frame, and the saddle, which are the innovative features on the accelerator. Accelerator. Good point. In addition, the prototype will ensure communication is clear. They will know exactly what we want. What we totally. want. Totally. Then I'll, I'll work on the sketch of the parts. And you might want to start with the description and specification of each. So, still, Martin, start working. All right. All right, excellent. Just to double check, do you still have any questions or maybe you have any questions about the, the vocabulary? No. No, perfect. Okay, excellent people, thank you very much. If you want, to, you can continue practicing, you can take turns yes. or you can uh, continue with part number three, all right? I will continue monitoring the other groups all right, if you guys please me, I'll be. Okay, teacher. Okay. One of the I think that are the, they need to um, put the product in the market from, from to sell the actual product, the actual product. Hello. We cannot hear you, Roberto. In the Hola. other reason, maybe can be the help or help the manufacturers to be very accurate with the design of the handlebars or with the, with the design. Roberto, hello. Hello. Can you hear Lucy? Yes. Yeah, I hear. But we cannot hear you very well. Hello? Christian, he's not available right now. I think he's busy. Okay. I'll let you guys continue. Let me go what are what are the distinctive features of the new product? 
to be very accurate. Hmm. ¿Cómo? ¿Qué dijimos que era accurate? To be accurate with the design of the handlebars. To be very accurate. 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 Uh -huh. Accu. Accurate. Yes. Accurate. With the sign. Let me show you how, how it is accurate. Accurate. Not red. Red. Accurate. Uh, he, you, you. Oh, let me show you that one in the chat. Do you see the chat? No? Uh, accurate. Yes. Accurate. Uh -huh. Yes, yes. Accurate. Accurate. Accurate, yes. It, it, okay. sounds, it sounds like accurate, but no, it's not rate. It's red. Accurate. Sounds like rate, but not accurate. Uh -huh, exactly, exactly. Accurate. Mm -hmm. Accurate. Okay. Thank you, teacher. Yes. Well, ens ensure? Ensure. Yes, ensure. Yes, ensure. Ensure. <clears throat> Start with the description of the technician. Just the matter is done all of them. It's clear. Then master. Okay. Vemos la segunda. Sí, sí. La segunda dice, what are the distinct features of the new product? ¿Cuáles son los features of the new product? Wow. I remember. Be great. Hey, then they say. This same innovative, they say, okay, which are the innovative feature? Mm -hmm. Innovative. Innovative. Innovative feature. Where? Innovator. The fray and the saddle. Which, which are the innovative features of the accelerator. Okay. Mm -hmm. right. so, said that the, the features. But I don't know if the, the sign of the Handle parts, the frame, and the saddle. Hi. The último. The the no the, the the phrase where Diana said I agree to. Here, look. Yes, thank you. Here, then the Diana says this, the innovation, yes, innovation feature. I think this is going to be the for the to the question number two. Teacher, on also we only have one reason. One Identify reason. One, one reason. Okay, okay. It says two, right? Yes. Yes. Okay, okay. That's okay, that's okay. Don't worry. Okay. <laughs> By the way, I would like to hear you guys practice. Can you do it? Okay. Yeah. I just want to hear you. I'm Diana. 
Yes. <laughs> of course. <laughs> the accelerator has been like to be produced. Now we need to work on the prototype. Great. I think our best choice is to hire a steel master. So they build a good prototype to help us spot any flaws we haven't identified in the design. I agree, Tom. The prototype will help our manufacturers to be very accurate with the design of the handlebars, the frame and the sandal, which are the innovative features on the accelerator. In addition, the prototype will ensure communication is clear. They will know exactly what we want. Totally. Then I work on the sketch of the parts, and you might want to start with the description and the specification of each. So, still, master, start working. All right. All right. Excellent. Hey, just uh, some quick uh, pronunciation uh, tips here. This one you can say proto. Prototype, all right? Prototype. Again, like that, proto, prototype. Or you can say proto, proto, right? Prototype. You got those two options, prototype or prototype. Whatever you say is good, all right? And uh, down here, we got this one, accurate. Accurate, all right? Accurate. 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 Yes, innovative over here. Innovative. 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 Yes, innovative. I think that's that's what it is. Yeah, yeah, pretty much. Okay. I'm sorry. <laughs> no, no, thank you. So, yes, but in my team, the, the distinct uh, features, what they were saying, is the part where Diana says that. on the innovative feature of the task task mm -hmm. yeah. what's the meaning of task Ta that's 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 in the question for man uh in the last in the last question uh what ah, do tasks. Task, uh, activities uh, activities responsibility activity. activities responsibilities or 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 tareas that's Tasks, exactly, okay. tasks. What two tasks will Diana and Tom before ordering the prototype to still master? This, uh, I will work on the sketch of the parts. And you might want to start with the description and a specific uh, spe description and specifications of each. I think uh, they are ah. they are those. Uh, the last question. The, I will work uh, work on the sketch of the parts and might want to start with the description uh -huh. and specification of each. I think it's that. I think it's those. Yeah, son como la... las actividades, tareas que tienen que realizar sí, antes sí, de, ajá, ajá. como de ordenarlo creo que es el prototipo sí. Sí. 
I hope. Fish are the innovative feature of the accelerator. Good point. In addition to prototype, will ensure communication is clear. They will know exactly what we want. Totally. Then I will work on the sketch of the parts and you might want uh, to start with the description and the specification of it. So it's the master start working. All right. Okay, you are Diana. The ex accelerator has green light to be products. Now we need to work on the prototype. Great. I think our best choice is to hire Skillmaster. So they build a, a good prototype to help us spot any flow we haven't identified in the design. I agree, Tan. The prototype will help our manufacturers to be very accurate with the signs of the hand handlebars, the frame, and the saddle, which are the innovation features of the accelerator. Good point. In addition, the prototype will ensure communication is clear. They will know exactly what we want. Totally. Then I will work on the of the on the stretch of the part, and you might want to start with description and a specific of each. So a steel master start working. All right. Okay, I'm Diana. Oh. <laughs> the accelerator has green light to be produced. Now we need to work on the prototype. Great. I think our the best choice of the here. A steel master so build a good prototype to help us spot and flow we haven't identified in the design. I agree, Tom. The prototype will help uh, will help our manufacturers to be very accurate with the design of the handlebars, the frame, and the saddle. Which are the innov innovative feature features on the accelerator? Good point. In addition to prototype, will ensure communication is clear. They will know exactly what we want. Totally. Then I work on the sketch of the parts, and you might want to start with the description and a specific and a specification of each. So, still masters start working. All right. <laughs> <laughs> all right. Yes, all right, all right. Yeah. Okay. Hey, guys. Uh, some uh, quick pronunciation tips here. Oh, wait, 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 over here. Oh, this one accurate. Accurate, all right? Accurate. Accurate. No, no, and, uh, contratar, ¿cómo? Accurate, not rate. Accurate. Uh -huh. Accurate. Accurate. Okay. Yes. Accurate. Let me. Uh, that would be like uh, in the chat. Accurate. Okay. Accurate. Accurate. Yes. And uh, contratar. Hire. Will the hire. Hire. Yes. Higher. Where is it? Where is it? Is it here? Higher? I don't see it. Oh, here. Uh, innovative. 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 And the next one? Features. 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 Yeah. With the features. Uh -huh, exactly. Features. Yeah. Mm. Innovative. Innovative. Feature. Innovative features. Innovative <laughs> features. Features. Innovative say, features. This one you can say proto, prototype, proto, like proto, all right? Prototype, or you can also say proto, prototype. 
for me, for me, prototype or to me, prototype sounds really good. Prototype okay. is good too, but it's like, uh, oh, okay. okay. All right. Okay. Very good. Excellent. Uh, let me see. Let me look this. All right. Guys, continue. Let me go to the last group. Okay. okay. I think nobody's available here, right? Only me, teacher. And why didn't you tell me? <laughs> <coughs> because I I I am late, and then I don't have where is it, where is the topic. Yes, I For know. That reason I stay silent and then waiting. <laughs> I think Ivan and Elivado are not really available for the moment. Yeah. Yes. And uh, we we kind of we kind of uh, we are kind of done with the activity, but maybe you can practice with one person for maybe a one 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 uh, one practice. What is the to the topic? Is that like you? Oh, we're talking about we're practicing a conversation and answering three questions about the conversation. Ah, okay, okay. Yes. Let me send you to a group and uh, tell them that you want to practice, please. Okay, thank you, teacher. Yes. Go ahead. There you go. Guys, no problem, okay? Finish teacher. Finish? Yes. yes. All right. Excellent. Wait, I my camera is off. Okay. Yeah, fantastic. <laughs> all right, all right. Very good. Sometimes I I look at me and I'm like, wow, you are very beautiful. And like <laughs> okay, I'm sorry, I'm sorry. It's not true, all right. Yes. You know, I've been I have received a lot of bullying these days. I have received a lot of bullying. You have no idea how much bullying I have received. For this, for this, for this. <laughs> a lot. Yes. All right, all right, guys. We're gonna go back to the main session soon. Let me go to this group. Yeah. Okay. Hey guys, you finished over here? Yes, teacher. Okay. We're ready then. We are ready. Okay. Ready. Yeah, we're gonna go back to the main session. So just let me go and see what Hector and Isabel are doing. They are the last ones. Okay. Hi, did you finish guys? Yes, yeah, teacher. You finished? I go back to the main session right now. Let's go, people. Let's go back. Let's go back. There we go. Okay, teacher. Yes. Hi. Hi, hi. We are back. We are back. Okay. <laughs> almost, almost. Let me just see. Let me see who's missing. Okay. Still in my stairs, so maybe I go try to help us put any. All right. I think everybody's back now. Excellent. Thank you very much for your participation. 
I was monitoring and I saw everybody participating. Excellent, amazing. Yes. All right, now let me share the book again here. And we're gonna go down to part number, number three. Fair work. Oh, you know what it says, right? But the first question says, what are two reasons Diana and Tom mentioned to build a prototype of the accelerator? Guys, can you mention the two reasons? Anybody? Hello. <laughs> can you hear me? Yes. <laughs> to be very accurate of the design, with the design. Come again, please. To be very accurate with the design. Okay, to be very accurate with the design. All right, all right. Is there another reason? Guys, is there another reason? Spot any flaw to the design. Okay, spot any flaw that the design might have. Okay, all right. So that's the second reason, right? Yes, it's two reasons. Thank you, thank you. Now we got the second question. What are the distinctive uh, features of the product? What are the distinctive pictures, pictures, sorry, of the new product, people? The frame, the frame and saddle. Okay, the frame and the saddle. All right, the frame and the saddle, yes. Okay, and they mentioned that these this, uh, new pictures, well, new, right? They are very, very innovative, right? It means recent or new. Modern. Number three, it says, what two tasks will Diana and Tom do before ordering the prototype to steel masters? Guys? The sketch of the part. Okay, the sketch of the part. All right, what else? It's two reasons there. Uh, the description and, and specification on each plant. Come again, please. It, the description and specification of each part. Okay, the description and specification of each part. Yes. Okay, yes. All right, all right, guys. Excellent, thank you very much for your participation over there. Now, we do not have a grammar topic, but look, we're going to study this paragraph for, for uh, a couple of minutes. And we're going to see which grammar structure we are using and how these structures are connected in a normal or a daily conversation or a conversation that happens in a place like this. Now, we have the first, the first and I'm going to underline the first sentence or the sentences. And you're going to mention the structures that they are using, all right? Just to kind of remember, uh, or just to try to remember the structures that we have studied before. Now, look at this. We got the, the accelerator has, has green lights to be produced. Do you remember this structure? The name? You don't? And, and we, we studied this, this structure like, like in, the, uh, in the very beginning. In the first lessons, we were talking about this, this topic or this grammar topic. No, you don't remember? It's okay. This one is called present perfect. Present perfect, remember? Yes, this one. With have, excuse me, no, it's not present perfect, it's simple present. My bad, my bad, my bad, okay, my bad. 
I thought it was a verb here, <laughs> but no, it's not a verb, it's a noun. Okay, look, it's not, it's not present perfect, it's simple present. Okay, look, we got the verb here, the verb is has. We got the, the subject, verb, I thought it was a verb, but I, my, my mistake, okay? Green light to be pronounced is the complement. Three things, this is simple present. The verb is here, has, okay? What about this one, guys? This structure, we need to work on the prototype. What about this one? We need to work on the prototype. What structure is that? Hello? No? It's the same one, the same one. We need, need is in the present, simple present. Okay, we need to we need to work on the prototype. All right. What about this one? I think our best choice is to hire steel masters. What structure is that? The same teacher. Okay, the same, the same structure, yes. Look, the verb, remember the verb is almost always after the subject. Okay, look. Think is the verb, think is in the present, it is simple present, the same structure. They build, they build a good prototype to help us spot uh, any flaw uh, up to here. What about this one? They build a good prototype to help us spot any flaw. What structure is that? Simple present. We're still talking about simple present. What about this structure? Uh, even though it's a single sentence, but this is a different structure. We haven't identified in the design. What structure is that? No. Nope. Simple past, we haven't identified. It looks, it looks like simple past. This is the one I mentioned before, in which in the in the one I made a mistake. This one is present perfect, have, and the verb in the past participle form. Okay, the verb is identified. It's not simple past. It's past participle because we have have and have is the auxiliary that we use for present perfect. Like they would bring us a verb. Okay, se ha verdiado. Se ha verdiado. like. In my mind, right? <laughs> I'm sorry, I apologize. All right. I agree, Tom. I agree, Tom. What about this one? What can you say about this structure? Simple present. Agree is in the present, it's not simple past, it's not past. So it is simple present. Look. The prototype will help our manufacturers to be very accurate with the design of the bot, well, all of it. Yes. What about this one, guys? Which structure is that? Uh, future. Yes, this one is future. Future, all right? This is future with will. Will is here, look. Okay, will is there and that's future, it means future. Look, look, the prototype will ensure communication is clear. What about this one? What structure is that? Future. Still future, right? Exactly, still future. They uh, look, yes, future. Look at this one. They will know exactly what we want. What about this one? Future. Future. The same, exactly, the same structure. Okay, simple future, look. With will, of course, with will. I'll work on the sketch of the parts. What about this one? Future. Sorry? Future? Yes, future, the same, all right. We got the auxiliary here and uh, with the, the subject, okay. You might want to start with a description. Oh, up to here. You might want to start with a description and specifications of each. What structure is that?
Hello. It's present. Present? Mm -hmm. Okay, okay. This word, this word expresses, well, the word might, the auxiliary uh, modal verb, sorry. The modal verb might expresses future possibility and present possibility, all right? So we can say that it's present and future at the same time. It's just, or we can simply say it's a possibility in the present, okay? Yes, so it is present. Very good, very good. Now, excellent guys, we're going to continue here. We're going to continue down here. Here, with this part over here. It says, building vocabulary, rank the advantages of prototyping uh, from most relevant from number one to least relevant number six. Discuss your ranking with a partner. All right, we got all these words over here. Excuse me, something stopped happening to my ear. I don't know, it feels funny. It's like a, 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 the sound of the wasp. I, I don't know, it feels weird. Okay, let me read this to you and let's clarify the vocabulary. Obtain more details to describe the product more effectively. Verify the functionality of the product. For example, identify flaws that were not foreseen in the design stage. Review initial product shapes of, or branding images. Elicit feedback from customers or early adopters. Assess the performance of various, mater various materials. Ensure potential manufacturers are capable of making the prototype sourcing the parts, putting them together, etc. Guys, do you have any questions about this vocabulary? Guys? Foreseen, teacher? Foreseen, uh, how can I explain this to you? Like see, see in the future, Ah, presa, here, I think it is in Spanish. Yes. It's like when you, you, you think about the future and you uh, take into consideration future, uh, can I tell you this? It's almost like prevent, okay? You think that something is going to happen, that is foresee. Foresee is the present, for so is the past form, and the past participle is foreseen. The same as the verb C. C. Thanks, teacher. More questions about the vocabulary? Teacher, no? what is what is elicit or oh, I don't know? Elicit. Elicit. It's it's almost in the Spanish. Ah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> I, I understand with the pronunciation. I, I understand. Elicit, elicit, yes. Yes. All right, all right. What is sourcing? No. Teacher, source, sourcing is like looking or searching? Mm, no, it, that's searching. Searching and looking. Uh, probably, yeah, yeah, you're right. You're right too. Yes, in a, in a, if you, if you understand it in a different context, probably so. But uh, sourcing is like the origin of something. Source is the origin of something. Okay, what's the origin of cell phones? Everything, everything that is inside is the origin of a cell phone. All right. Yes. So the origin is like ooh, we have to go uh, deep. All right, to find the source of something. For example, one question I can ask you is, uh, let me see, I'm thinking, I'm thinking, I'm thinking, I'm thinking. All right, let's say for example, that we want to find out who was the first person, who was the first person that built a house in El Salvador. 
it's going to be very difficult, but the source, the source is the person, right? That or the first person, the origin, the origin of something. That's what it is. Now, very good. Guys, in the same groups, we're going to order them, all right? With the same people, we're going to put them in order from the most relevant to the least relevant. Yes, read them carefully and, uh, well, select the, the one that you think is number one, number two, three, four, five, and six. All right, the same ones, let's go. Let's go, let's go. I'll see you guys there. Could you, could you send to me again, please? Yes, of course. Don't worry. Teacher, I am still here. Yes. Okay. This. What happened? This is my group. No. Okay. 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 Mm -hmm. I'm waiting. Let me send you to a group, but don't join that one. Don't join this one. Wait, don't join this one. You were not in this group. You were number six. Number six. There you go. Okay. The same thing will happen. I don't know what happened. Hello. Hi, I'm here. It's not, it's not the same. No, wait. Let me do it again. Don't enjoy that one. Wait. No, it's not. It's not important. It's okay. Number six. Number six. No, it's not this one. That one. Okay. Porque dice run the advantage of prototype from host to the other. Obtain product review it, shelf product shelf or branding it may. I'm not sure. Because I, I think when you when you have a a prototype, you have already the product now. I think the feedback from the customer is on. This is the reason therefore the prototype. Huh? I think the the reason to design the prototype is uh, Elis, elixir feedback. No. Uh -huh. Number From one. No, number two. On number two. Okay. Sí, ahí hay que darle como ponerles como el numerito del orden. ¿no? Pero 
Pero es de ver qué es. ¿Cuál es el tercero? Dice, if you eat the product or run too much. Ah, es como revisar la forma del, del producto. Number two. Dice la otra es obtener más información, más detalles para escribir, para escribir productos más eficientemente. ¿Esta será la tres? Potential. Ensure potential manufacturers are capable of making the prototype. Sourcing the parts, putting them together. Mm -hmm. Dice elicit, que dijimos que era elicit. Elicit. Yo no creo que es elicit. Elicit. Ajá. What is it? Parece. I'm sorry, what is the question? Uh, what do you mean with elicit feedback? Oh, elicit, elicit, elicit. Mm -hmm. It's like get, get feedback. Uh, <laughs> provocar in Spanish, provocar like sacar. Mm. But, but not like, like by force. I mean, mm -hmm. uh, motivate a person to give you feedback. Como retroalimentar. Pretty much, pretty much, yes, yes. Mm -hmm. Yes. Ok, for me it's number four. I think. Hello. I think we when well, I think we finished but Are you almost done, people? Yes. Yes. You're done or you're almost? Done. Okay. We're done. 
Okay, fantastic. Excellent. Mm -hmm. More F. Mm -hmm. Sí. Number three. Number three. Um, verify. The functionality of the product. Podría ser. Um, review initial products. la review. Like, number three. Number one. Ensure potential manufacturing. Number two, obtain more detail to describe the product more effective. Number three, review initial product. Number four, verify the functional. Functionality. Post Pro A identify from that we're not. Bueno, si, si nos equivocamos, lo único que puedo, lo más es que lo corrijamos. No. Así no lo entiendo. No, don't worry, the answers, the answers may, may vary. Ok, ok, teacher. Yes. Are you guys done? No. Almost. 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 Okay. Let me go to this group right now. Okay. Hi. Happy with the numbers. <laughs> I think that this is the. If this is my opinion. Laura, okay, yes, it's difficult without sound. Okay, this is my opinion, teacher. Okay. What do you think okay. about? Well, it's difficult to see because it's, it's uh, I don't know. How to <laughs> okay, the number one is obtain more details to describe the product more effectively. Okay, uh, after that, we ask the performance of various met materials. And then we verify the functionality of the product, identify flow that were forcing, is the correct pronunciation, forcing. Forcing, yes, forcing, forcing. Forcing in the design stage. Mm -hmm. then, then of that, we ensure potential manufacturers are capable of making the prototype, sourcing the parts, putting, putting them together, etc. And number five, review the initial product shapes or branding images. Images. And the legs one? Hmm? Images. Images. Yes, images. Okay, maybe could be... Okay, what is that? Maybe I will change that. This is number five, and it is number six. Look like that. Okay. Hi. My phone. <laughs> okay. It, it is my opinion. It's okay. Your opinion is okay. Look. Look at Pamela's opinion in the chat. It's two, four, uh, four, bear, five, functionality. Okay, the next is two, four, one, five, three, six. Two, four, one, two, four. 
One is review the initial project from Brandon and Mesh. <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> I, I don't I don't know too, Pamela. <laughs> and you know what? What the worst thing? I don't know too. Okay. Yes. But I'm agree with you. I agree with you. The thing yeah. is, the thing is that the answers, the answers may vary, you know. The rank, the rank can be different. Yes. It can have a different order. So don't worry, okay? <laughs> it depends about but, our way to think. Yes. But I think I think but I think we can get we can get at least at least the correct order, you know. Because there are some of them that are, you know, the least important. And we, we can get them, yes. All right. Uh, yes. We're gonna go back to the main session right now. Okay. I will continue okay. right. Hold on. Right away. Yeah. Let's go back. Hi, we are waiting for the, the rest time. I think everybody is back. Well, almost. Now everybody's back. Yes. Hello. Okay, we are back. Uh, okay, guys, listen to this. Uh, we are gonna share the order, all right? Yes, we got them over here. The order, the order can be different, you know? It can be different, it can vary. But let me tell, let me see, let me see. Let me ask you, which one do you think is number one? Guys, which one do you think is number one? Review initial product shapes and branding image. Okay, which one is that one? Oh, yes, this one, right? This one you think. Guys, do you agree with Christian's answer? Do you agree with Christian? We think verified the functionality of the product is a number one. Okay. You, you think this one is number one too, okay? Does anybody there have, has a different one? I mean, the same one in different position? Have you considered another one to be number one? No, only those two? Teacher. Teacher. Yes. In sure potential. Manufacturer er, capable, no sé cómo pronuncias. Capable. Capable. Marking the prototype. No. Probably so, yes, making the prototype. Yeah, probably, probably. It has a, a, a may, might, might be, you know. But I think the, the closest, the closest ones, ones to be the first one are these two. I think they are the, 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 you know, it can be the first one or the second one or vice versa. Yes. Remember, the, the order can be can be different, okay? It can vary. Which one do you consider is number two over here? Let's choose, let's choose this one as number one. All right. And this one as number two because we, we got it, right? Yes. Now, which one do you consider number three here? Or which one would, would you consider number three? The first one. 
obtain the more details. One. Assess the performance? No, the, the first. Oh, the first one, this one. Mm -hmm. Okay. Guys, do you agree with Christian? Yes? Okay. I'll take yeah. it as a yes. I'll take it as a yes. Okay. Thank you. Thank you. Number four. Which one do you think is number four? Guys? Which one do you think is number four? <clears throat> We got elicit feedback from customer. Feedback uh -huh, from customer. Yep. Okay. I think I think I think everyone will agree with Hector. I agree with Hector. I think this one can be number. Excuse me. This one up here. My bad. My bad. Did I see it? I agree. But this one is number four. Now, which one is number five and number six, guys? Guys. Five and six. Okay, I would say five teacher access yes. the performance. Yes, number five. Okay, okay, okay. This one number five. Oops. And this one number six. Guys, right, so you agree with Hector? Yes. I think I think these two these two can be wait. How can I do this? I think these two can be inter you know in the same uh, wow this thing is big. My bad. Yeah, make it smaller. It can be done, right? But I think these two can be, you know, in the these two and these two over here. You can change the position of them, no problem. The other ones, I think they go in that way. Okay. But like I said, the order can be different. The answers can vary, you know. It's okay. It's okay. Now, let me erase this. Now, let's gonna continue. Let's continue. Let's then I can see what, what did I say? Uh, number five, your turn. Group work. Okay. We're going to go back with the same people, all right? With the same people. It says, uh, go back to the new products uh, description you created in uh, unit number one. We're not going to do that. Like, we're going to make it a little easier this time. We are going to select the products. Okay, you can select them, you, your decision. And then it says here, the first thing that we're going to do about the product that we decide or we select, it's gonna be this, make, it, make the list of pictures. Oh, sorry, prepare a presentation. Right, that's the first thing. Prepare a presentation. The second thing, you're going to choose whatever product you want. Okay, it's gonna be up to you. The second thing that we're going to do after the product selection, it's make the list of pictures as specific, as detailed as possible. The third thing that we're going to do is brainstorm the materials needed to create a prototype. And the last but not least, this one. List the benefits of building a prototype of your new product. Yes, that's what we are going to do. Yes. Before we continue, do you have any questions? Yes. No? We're good. We're good. Uh, teacher. Yes. Uh, the prototype is going to be virtual or, or just digital or in physical. No, no, just, just the description. I think, I don't know how you can, you can make something a prototype, mm -hmm. but if you are, if you are creative enough, you, you can come up with something. It's okay. <laughs> Okay, thank you. All right. Let me take you back with the same people. If there's a person that is not available in this moment, I'm going to take you to a different group, okay? Just give me a little time and be patient with me because I, I monitor everything. It's just kind of difficult. Wait, somebody left here. 
I'm going to change her to another one. There. All right. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Me está diciendo que hay que crear una presentación. Yes, exactly, exactly, exactly. Here, let me show you. Here. Haremos una presentación, ok. Vamos a elegir cualquier producto que ustedes, que ustedes gusten, que ustedes les guste, que ustedes quieran. Y haremos una lista de las características, dice, de una forma muy específica o muy detallada. Así está. Uh -huh. yes. Luego vamos a generar ideas acerca de los materiales que ocupamos para poder crear un, un prototipo. Y al final, dice, vamos a enlistar los beneficios de construir un prototipo del producto. Yes. That is the presentation. Okay. Choose uh, something easy, something easy, an easy product. Yes, let me stop here. All right, I will give you guys time to, to, to start. Energizante. Energizante, ener energy, uh -huh. Sabor dulce. Energy. Energy. Uh -huh. We love soda. I love yeah. soda. Sweet testing. <laughs> sweet, no, sweet, ¿qué, ¿cómo se dice? What? Ah, sweet test. Sabor dulce, sweet. Ah, sweet. Yeah, yeah sweet taste. Uh -huh, sweet. You can you can you can say sweet just sweet sweet. <laughs> it's okay. 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 Sweet. Yeah. It will be like redundant, right? Sweet uh -huh. taste or sweet <laughs> or flavor. Uh -huh. I want to drink. ¿Cómo se, ¿cómo se yeah. energizante? Sorry, energy drink. Energy. Uh -huh. Energy uh -huh. drink. Energizing. Energizante. Energy drink. 
Uh-huh. Do you need one right now? <laughs> 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 I need one. Yeah. Yeah. I, I, I prefer. I prefer Do coffee. You? Exactly. Yes, I prefer coffee. Yeah, coffee. Uh, yeah. Yes. Esta hora no duermo. <laughs> Me, wake up. <laughs> oh no, that's not good. <laughs> okay. Another one. Detail. Innovador. Solo que casi no le escuché lo último que me di. ¿Pupusas? Ah, sí, 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 si usted quiere podemos hacer una, sí. O inventémonos una. Yes, it works, it works, it's good, it's good. It's easy, easy. Mm -hmm. <laughs> you, you don't Entonces, have many products. Ok. O oh, oh, yeah, broma, oh. yeah, that's cheese. Uh, stuff, oil, yeah, right? Mm -hmm. Beans. Okay. Okay, Joanne. The, the futures are the new things that Trudeau has, right, teacher? Sorry, yes. The, the future, in this case, with the pupusas is the new thing or the different. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Okay, we are going to make colorful pupusas. Wow. <laughs> it, re reminds me, it reminds me of this uh, uh, SpongeBob episode. With the colorful kangaroo burgers, remember? <laughs> uh -huh, yeah. Yeah, that was a good episode. Yes. yes. All right, guys. Go ahead. Continue. Sorry. Okay. Don't say in Hello. Queens. Sisters. Pamela, can I speak right now? No. No le sirve el micrófono. Oh yeah, it's true. It is true. It's, I'm sorry. You know, yeah, you should you should uh, destroy that computer. <laughs> I think you know. I think my computer in, it's in in worse conditions. This computer is bad. My computer is really really bad. Yes. <laughs> yes. I'm sorry. Okay. All right, all right. Continue, guys. You are working. Y tiene que ser bien específico. Sí. Sí, lo más específico posible. Podemos crear también cobijas. Y fundas para almohadas, digamos. Cojines. No. Solo las fundas. Uh... Con diseños personalizados. Y es esta fácil. Por los materiales. Share, Holman, share with us. Se me fue el. No me está fallando el wipe ahorita. Hey, the service. Ya lo pagué. 
<laughs> yes. Continue, guys. Sugar, water, artificial dyes, caffeine, soda, and what else? For, for what? For a soda? Yeah. For a soda. Yes. Include a little alcohol. No, 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 I'm kidding. I'm kidding. No, 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 it's a, it's a, it's a. <laughs> okay. No, it's Friday, it's Monday today. <laughs> okay, yeah, it's true. It's, I'm sorry, I'm sorry, it's not Friday, it is true. <laughs> I apologize. It's too early. It's too, it's too early, yeah. It's the too early. <laughs> okay, list the benefit. I do also benefit. Mm -hmm. benefit. Okay, wake up when you have, you have dreams. Wake up. <laughs> list the benefits. Ah. No make a mistake there. No. Teacher, yes, I'm here. Uh, so features can be one color dog and mixed color dog. What? Yeah. I'm sorry, what? One color dog or masa de un solo color. Mm. I don't know. Is that does that, so, that exist? I think it's it's not common. I think or mixed color, artificial color color says that over there. Uh, Robert, uh -huh, yeah, artificial color sounds better. Sounds better. Artificial. Artificial color dove. Mm -hmm. Uh, it I can be a, a spice, a spicy or spicy, como picante. Mm -hmm. So, and tell me about them. Oh, wait, ahorita reviso, quiero ver. Mm, ese, ajá, la lista de, de los materiales. Helmet. With the smart helmet. Oh. With eh, Con conexión a Bluetooth. <laughs> connections. With Bluetooth Lube. connection. Ajá. Tu, así. Bluetooth. Con una... Hey. Bluetooth TH al final. Así. Bluetooth Connection. Hey, ¿por qué Roars? Escribí mal Roars. ¿Qué es? Teacher. Hi. Eh, Roars. I don't know. Roars. O solo. Roll. Roll. 
Roar. 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 Without wanting the chat? Without S. Wait, wait, you were taking Please send yes. That one? Ah, Roar. 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 Yes, the one in the chat. Uh huh. Uh -huh. Where do you see that word? Ah, road. Road. Roar. What's the context? What is the context? Read the sentence. This is a double, double, a double propósito para usar en campo y en ciudad, en caminos rurales y en caminos y en ciudad, una moto. Ah, road, yes, road camino. Ah, okay. Y aquí, Bluetooth. Bluetooth. Uh -huh. Blue. Ah, no, lleva. Ahí está. Bluetooth connection. Y la última, pongamos una última más. ¿Cómo que la puedes fixear? <ríe> o sea, que la puedes tunear. I don't see anything here. I see your. I see your... What are you talking about? <laughs> I see you the can, you can can see the the PowerPoint. I'm sorry. You can see the PowerPoint. No. no. I see the book. Really? Yes. Como aquí para dejar de compartir. And again. Compartir. Now? Yes, now I see yeah. that. Exactly, yes. Yes. <laughs> I don't know why, but uh -huh. like, I was I was seeing the seeing the book. <laughs> yes. No but, uh, you cannot cannot you see. I can see now. It. I can now. Yes, yes, I can. Ah, now. Okay. Okay, okay. Okay. It doesn't uh, we we search the last uh, specification our our product. Our product is the motorcycle XP uh, 150. Yeah. Uh, and uh, pixel in any ¿Cómo sería? Uh, We're going to go back to the main session right now. I'm going to do this hold on. Because it's late. Okay. And don't worry. Fix it. Es reparar, ¿verdad? Yes, yes. Re fix it. Repair. Fix it or repair. Let's In many. Back. Yes, let's go back. In many... Um, ¿Cómo sería? Ok. Híjole, esto no va a cerrar el tiempo, mira. Uh -huh. Ya. Yeah. ¿Cómo se llama taller? Eh, taller, taller. ¿Cómo sería taller? Pu? I'm sorry, they are still barking. My dogs are barking, not so much anymore, but they were barking a lot. 
I'm sorry. I hey guys, it's already 10, 10 p.m. We're going to stop here. Apparently, the, the activity took longer than expected. Do not worry about that. We're going to continue tomorrow. I already have a picture of the people in the groups. And the first thing that we're going to do tomorrow is present the activity. Do you have any questions? Okay, guys, one thing here about the platform. Today, we start unit number three. So you better, or it's a good idea for you to start working on section number three. If you are already working on section number three, that is good. If you finished section number three, even perfect. Yes. All right. Yes. Okay. If we don't have any questions, let me go and take attendance and then we will be free to go and sleep. Let me see. Adriana Maria Turcios. Present. Hello. Yes. Hello. This person new. Carlos Elivaldo Abrego Marmol. No, we don't see him over there. Is he here? No. Yes, he's there. All right, all right. Let me see. Christian, thank you, Carlos. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Christian Alexander Arevalo Delgado. Present teacher. Christopher Espitia Chipagua. Did he leave? Oh, he, he left, right? No. Well, we don't know what happened to him. Okay, sorry. Uh, Fatima Denise Aguilar Marquez. Present teacher. Yes. Gabriel, Gabriel Beltran Perez. Present teacher. Hector Francisco Morales. Present. Isabel Hernandez Hernandez. Present. Ivan Petrovich Guzman Aquino. Holman Saul Giron Sanchez. Present. Laura Yasmin Portillo Andres. Present. Lucy Natalie Juarez de Ramirez. Present. Hello, Magdaleno Escalante Orantes. Present, teacher. Nelson Antonio de Rodas Rosales. Present, teacher. Oscar Armando Romero Mendoza. Hey, Oscar. Let me see, let me check. All right. But I don't know what happened to him. Apparently he was having uh, connection problems and then he vanished. We don't know what happened to him. Okay, so no, right. Pamela Carolina Molina Guevara. No? Ah, yeah, microphone, right? <laughs> yes, sorry. Roberto Carlos Hernandez Cruz. Roberto, no, and uh, Rosalina Alvarado. Present teacher. All right, guys, excellent. Thank you very much. Uh, well, if you have any questions, you can stay. Okay, you can stay with me, no problem. If you don't, then uh, guys, I will see you tomorrow. Have a good night, sleep. All right, just. Rest and uh, well, I will see you tomorrow. Take care. Good night. 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 Hey guys, I'm back here. Uh, we're gonna review the vocabulary for uh, for today's lesson or of today's lesson. I'm gonna show you the book again and we're gonna review the vocabulary that we learned, the new vocabulary, okay? 
Uh, we were talking about prototype. This is the word over here. Prototype or prototype, it's when the product starts or it's the very beginning of a product. Before we have the cell phones in our hands, there are prototypes uh, just to, to see if the product works perfectly. Okay, that's the prototype. And uh, well, in the conversation, we have a few words to, to, to look at. The first one that we have, it's the word, the same word, prototype. Okay, it's down here. Look, we got it there, All right? I told you what this is. To hire, to hire is to give a person a job, all right? Maybe there are three or four applicants. You hire the best applicant or the, pe the person that meets the specifications. Now, that's to hire. Then we have very, uh, okay, uh, over here, flaw. A flaw is something bad or something not perfect something that has a deficit. That's a flaw. For example, humans, we have flaws. We make mistakes when we speak. We make mistakes when we, when we write, okay, etc. We make a lot of mistakes. We make bad decisions. That's what we call flaws. Or maybe it's something physical, all right? Yes, we have a flaw. Another word that we were uh, looking at was this one, accurate, all right? The pronunciation is accurate. It's not accurate. Maybe you will hear this word from someone else, but the correct pronunciation is accurate, right? That's the correct pronunciation. Yes, and it means, it means exact, okay? To be very exact, that's what it means here to be very exact with the design. Now, uh, also we had handlebars. You know what, I, what handlebar are, right? Where you, where you put your hands. Yes, yeah, the frame and the saddle. The saddle is where you sit. Also, we were talking about this word's pronunciation. It's difficult pronouncing this word or to pronounce this word. Innovative, that's the pronunciation. You might hear innovative, Okay, but the correct one is innovative, all right? Innovative. Pictures over here. Pictures, all right, pictures. Uh, let me see, hey, we got a, a transition word over here in addition. Uh, and then we have, well, we kind of know all of this. Yes, all right, very good. Down here, we got the same vocabulary in the questions. Over here, we got more vocabulary that we learned today. And uh, well, look, flaws here in the plural form. Up there, we had it in the singular form, only one. And over here, we got it in the plural form, which means two, three, four, five, et cetera. Also, this one foreseen is when you see the future, okay? Or when you predict what is going to happen. Yes, okay. Uh, yeah, only that one. Oh, elicit is when you, motivate people to give you insight, to give you opinions or to give you feedback, yes? But you motivate them to give you their opinions or their feedback. Uh, another one that we were looking at was this one, uh, assess, you know, assess is evaluate, evaluate, uh, capable, the pronunciation is capable. Sourcing, I was telling you that is the, the origin of something, the beginning of something, that is the sourcing, all right? Yes. And that's uh, what we were talking about and then the activity that we have for tomorrow. Guys, please work on it if you can. All right, and I will see you guys tomorrow. I right, have a good night, sleep well, and I wish you the best. Remember, practice makes perfection. You need to continue practicing, practicing every single day. If you practice, you will improve. If you improve, if you, improve you will have more opportunities and your communication skills are going to be very, very good. All right, guys, I wish you the best. I will see you next time. That means tomorrow. Okay, bye.